Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel U Flute. So for today's lesson, we will be learning the parts of the flute and how to assemble the flute. So let's get on to the video. Okay, so our first topic is learning the parts of the flute. So there are three parts to the flute. The first one is the head joint, and the head joint has the lip plate. We talked about the lip plate in the previous video um, where we learned how to blow into a flute. Within the lip plate, there is the lip hole, where you blow into the flute. And at the beginning of the head joint, there is the crown over here. Over here. Okay, so another thing that I wanted to mention, I didn't include this in the video, I forgot. But basically, there is this thing called the tenon. And the tenon is at the end of the head joint. So it looks very matte, like it's not shiny like the rest of the flute. So this is the part that's actually going into the body. Um, the whole entire head joint is not going into the body or else, you know, how are you going to play? But that's the part that is going into the body. And, and I will get into that later on in the video. Okay, so next is the body. So the body has, you know, most of your keys here. And the receiver. So the receiver is where you put your head joint into the body. Um, but, but we will be getting into that further into the video. Okay, last but not least is the foot joint. And the foot joint has the remaining keys. Okay, so now that we have identified and talked about the parts of the flute, let's talk about assembling the flute. So we're going to start off with the body of the flute. And let's talk about the receiver. So what we're going to do is we are going to put the head joint into the body. By twisting in the head joint into that little hole, or should, I guess like medium sized hole, into the hole of the receiver. And what I like to do is I like to twist and turn instead of just like pushing it down so that I don't damage the flute. Okay, so, so what I like to do is I like to leave a little bit of that area outside of the body of the flute. And I like to have it like, I guess, half of a fingernail. But that's just like an estimate. It's different for everyone. So what this does is that it helps tune your flute. Most instruments need tuning, and that includes the flute. So this is just a way for you to tune your instrument depending on whether you want your sound to be more flat or more sharp. Okay, another thing that I want to mention is that um, you want to line your lip hole with the first key of the body. And I like to do that by putting my flute at an angle and just closing one eye. So I'm going to use one eye to determine that. And you can just twist and adjust your head joint to make it aligned with that first key. Okay, so now that we have gotten the head joint into the body, let's talk about the foot joint. So again, I'm just going to twist like I did with the head joint, but I'm not doing it with the foot. So one more thing that I want to mention is that I don't want my first key of the foot joint to be like directly aligned with the last key of the body. I want to have it at an angle. So this will make more sense when we get into fingering and learning different notes. Um, this just causes less strain on your fingers while you are playing. Of course you don't have to do this, but you know, it's just something that if you don't want your fingers to be strained and you just want your fingers to be more relaxed. And this also helps when you are playing faster pieces because then you, your fingers won't hurt. Okay, so that is how you assemble the flute. So in this video, we talked about the parts of the flute and assembling the flute. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you really like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for future videos. Comment down below for any suggestions or comments. That's what it's called. The comments, but yeah. Um, about my videos, I would love to hear from you. Okay, so... In next week's lesson, we will be learning about different notes and fingering. In the description box down below, there is a link to my website where there is more information about you flute. Thank you guys and bye fluters!
Bye, fluters.